Welcome to this video tutorial. We are looking at a smashing top brand answer. It is a 10 marker from paper 2 2019 and it is about churches and how they may act as a conservative force. So here is a question that we are looking at today and we're going to break this down into firstly outline and explain what that means is that you are you need to identify and explain what that is. In this case, it is the way. And another word for a way is the steps, the processes of how something occurs. We are linking two parts of the specification together. So we've got churches, which is part of your religious organizations. And we want to look at the features and how they may act as a conservative force. Or what that means is that you are maintaining society in a certain way. You are preserving the status quo and you could be referencing some of your sociological theories when you are answering this question. A quick glance at the mark scheme is always very, very helpful. So answers in this band will show very good sociological knowledge and understanding, and you'll get that through concepts, keywords, and um, anything that is relevant, any specialist terms that may be explained to show that deep understanding um, of the ways in which a church may act as a conservative force. There will be two applications of relevant material. So linking how churches may help create stability, for example, or there being linked to the establishment and how that maintains the norms and values of society and there will be also appropriate analysis the extent to which churches always act as a conservative force for example a little bit of the indicative content is there for you to have a little bit of a look at and we'll come back to that later on as you can see, the student has written quite a chunky paragraph and I've highlighted in different colours the different parts of the question that you've got to reference. So the church and its characteristics are in yellow and also some examples from within a church that backs it up, um, how, how it is a conservative force and that is mostly in green and that is more about what it is conserving. In this case, it's capitalism and it's from a Marxist theory perspective and finally the analysis is in a lilac colour right at the bottom so this student starts off with using the wording from the question so one way in which the church acts as a conservative force is it is an ISA an ideological state apparatus so something that you might want to refer to is Althusser who talks about this idea of a brainwashing function and this is necessary for the revolution in line with Marxist thinking we don't want people realizing that they're being exploited and it maintains capitalism so that's the angle that this student is going with we've got a characteristic from the church here so it has a large membership and then it goes back to talking about what is being conserved or preserved here so it can um, continues to oppress the most marginalized group in preventing a revolution required for freedom from a capitalist system Marx argues that churches act as a conservative force we've got a lovely link back to the question that it's maintaining the student focus on the answer as the opium of the people, an idea that was later developed by Lenin in terms of a spiritual gin. And then they explain that they understand what this is. It hides the reality of alienation. We go back to our examples from the church here. So the that God made the world and rich and poor, which is prominent in him, such as all things bright and beautiful. So we've got some application there. We've got further characteristics of what the church is. It is an established bureaucratic hierarchy. It is very closely tied to the nation state. And this maintains the oppression of the working class through the teachings, such as the virtues of hard work being rewarded in heaven. OK, so that is our church and how it is a conservative force. We're going to finish our paragraph off with our analysis at the end. And this student, um, what they do is they go into a little bit more detail or they dig a little bit further. They recognise that churches may become denominations and sects or churches might have different values that they may be promoting. In this case, they may have the potential to drive social change or they may create a counter hegemony like neo-Marxist. Um, such as Gramsci would talk about. 
So thinking about your second paragraph, it is a really good idea to check out the mark scheme from paper two 2019 so you can have a go at writing a second paragraph. Following the structure that I've just gone through, you might even want to highlight your answers to show the different parts of the question so you know that you are getting those marks. The examples that typically my students wrote about were about the functionalist theory, maintaining social solidarity, maintaining a collective conscience, or even feminist ideas of how the church, through the teachings and practices, maintain patriarchy. And they used examples from the established churches. Um, finally, look for opportunities for analysis as well. So do all churches do this? Are there different forms of feminism, for example, which might actually um, provide some analysis? Lastly, the examiner report always gives you a useful insight to what the examiner was looking for. And as you can see here, some students misinterpreted the question of what conservative force is. They talked about social change. Um, if you do not do that application or you misinterpret part of the question, you may be capping your marks at three. Um, a few answers had two ways, but they were very similar in their explanations. So that means that they were only credited for one and all the answers gave examples of only one way. Um, but most students were able to answer this question quite well and they were able to apply sociological ideas because they knew it was about sociological theory, really, and how religion maintains, um, a, you know, maintains or conserves society in a certain way. So massive thank you for watching. Make sure that you click that like button. Please subscribe. I am doing questions all the time. There is a playlist on beliefs, so check that out. There are other questions that are on there and also check out my other papers, paper one and paper three. I've got loads of videos for you. Have a great day. Take care.